Here's a fun fact from the movie Black Hawk Down. There's a scene in the movie where Dominic Pilla's actor is doing a skit about Captain Mike Steele. One, two, ten. Okay, where are my running backs? Where are my running backs? Hey, I didn't see you at church on Sunday, soldier. You had something more important to do? Not on Sunday, you don't. Not anymore. I will make you believe, you understand? Pretty funny, huh? <laughs> yeah. Good impression. I recognize myself. All right, carry on. Quick word, specialist. Sir? Tell me, Pillow. You understand why we have a chain of command, don't you? Why do that, sir? Because if I ever see you undermining again, you'll be cleaning the trains with your tongue so you can't taste the difference between shit and french fries. We'll be clear. Who, cool, sir? All right. Skits were incredibly popular when we were deployed overseas or when we were going anywhere for training. You got to imagine that guys are spending hours or days, or in this case, months away from music and television and entertainment. And so one of the ways that we just wanted to blow off a little bit of steam, one of the ways that we tried to entertain ourselves is by allowing the lower enlisted guys in the unit to put on a little play. I can't tell you how funny, how hilarious some of these were because of the incredibly bright, very observant guys in the unit. Now you turn a private loose to make fun of and pick on anybody in the unit with no rules, no restrictions, they're gonna notice some things, they're gonna highlight those things, and when they start to portray those things in our skit night, it was brutal and hilarious at the same time. As a leader, a squad leader, I was more than once the subject of a skit during skit night. And what they said was brutal but hilarious at the same time. In this scene in the movie Black Hawk Down, you see Dominic Pilla's character doing this skit. And that's because he was, without a doubt, one of the funniest guys I've ever met in my life. In fact, he was kind of the joker of the unit. And if you wanted somebody who could get everyone in the unit laughing, it was Pilla. No, mon no wonder it was so devastating for a lot of people, myself included, when Pilla was killed in action because all of us loved him and we, we loved him because he was a great warrior who made us laugh. Don't get us, don't get me wrong. I loved all of those guys out there. But the guy who makes you laugh, you really, really miss that when they're not around. So on skit night, any leader, any situation, no matter how absurd, could become falling out of your chair hilarious because of how observant, how intelligent, how accurate, but also how funny those guys were. Not long ago in the United States, there was a strike with from the writers of some of the funniest, some of the biggest television shows in the country. And I thought to myself, if you wanted to replace some of those writers, all you need to do is get some of the guys that created and conducted the skits that we uh, held during skit night when I was in the Ranger Regiment. What I'm trying to tell you is those skits were far funnier than what you see in the movie. And that scene in the movie actually happened. We did skit night inside the hangar on the airfield in Mogadishu, Somalia. And I will remember how hilarious some of those skits were for the rest of my life. Just a fun fact for you from the movie Black Hawk Down.